Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. We're getting hit by another round of Earthbound Undertale likes. There's another one out on the market now. Came out recently. But how recently? It came out on May 14th. Somehow I missed this. I've been looking forward to this game for a while. For quite a while. <clears throat> oh, let's not do let's 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 not do ultra kill music. That does not quite fit the mood mood? The mood for tonight. Welcome to the stream, Dark Woods. But yeah, we're getting hit by another wave of earthbound. Damn. That is loud. Hold on. Let me get the game up here. Uh, this game is apparently... It's hard to not make the comparison to Undertale. It really, really fucking hard. So, we'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see how good it is. I liked Undertale. Uh, even though I didn't play it on stream. I was not streaming at that time. I would have been like... <sighs> how, how old is Undertale at this point? Hey, Nerf boy! Welcome to the stream! I see you found it. But yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and get right into it. Uh, cause... I, I've wanted to play this for a very long time. It's almost nine years old? Oh my god. Here are the game's controls. Uh, I'm on a controller. You can change these keys in the options menu later. Uh, I'll figure it out. Don't worry about it. Your name, please. I guess we're doing all caps. Yeah, there's there's no way to... Okay, yeah, we're just doing all caps. Jesus, nine years. And you look like... Oh, I didn't know you could pick a character. Uh, we'll just do... We'll do the base guy. Let me know if the game is too loud. It, it might be a little, just a wink too loud, I'm not sure. It's kind of hard to tell just based off the mixer, but... Oh, my birthday! You want to know my birthday? It's June 14th. We're almost there. I'm almost 26. It is too loud? Okay, I got you, I got you. How about there? How about right there? Is that better? That's the best day of the year! Congrats! Okay, perfect. Perfect. Audio is good. Alright. Now, I'm just gonna ask you a few more questions about your personality. Oh, I don't have one of those. They're important, trust me. Ready? You have to cut off one of your fingers. Which one is it? Pinky. Pinky finger. Oh, I, I can't say pinky finger? Both thumbs. I need those! I play video games with those. Pointer? No. I play video games with those. Pinky's going. None of them. None of them is an answer. Or all of them. And then I could have robot hands. All of them. Do you want to be someone that others look up to? Uh, yes. So badly. A friend of yours is being bullied. What do you do? Uh, probably just defend them. Screech until the bully leaves. Cry and throw up. Pretend not to see. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll jump to their side. You have a tough exam tomorrow. This feels like Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. You have a tough exam tomorrow. Do you study? No. Uh, <laughs> I eat the paper, start growling, and mean mug everyone in the room. Absolutely. Do you have a lot of friends... Not really. Uh, I do, but... Do I really consider them all friends? Is the real question. Because I have a lot of people that I'm associated with. Uh, I'll say yes. I'll say yes. The question is, do I consider them friends? Do you often run late? No. 
No. I'm so punctual it hurts. If you could create your own planet, what would you call it? <laughs> Fucking Earth 2. Planet Mako. All right, I'm letting the ego take over. The ego's taking over. Your teacher is accusing you of cheating on the final exam. Yeah, because I was cheating. Actually, I did cheat on my finals when in high school. Are you beef? Like, are you tough? Uh, it's, um, please don't hurt me. Someone hurt you. I said don't. How does that make you feel? Um, I want to understand why. Uh-oh, there's a burglar in your house. What do you do? I shoot them. I, I shoot them. Break their skull with my hands. Uh, stop. This isn't you. No, I, I'd probably fucking shoot him. I'm going to be honest. Well, that's all the questions I've got. Thanks for being a good sport. This is super important to the start of your Athenian Rhapsody. I, that's morbid, but I mean, shit, if that's someone's breaking into my house, I don't know what they're going in there for. So far, you seem like someone with an insatiable curiosity and a tendency to be a bit erratic at times. I mean... Maybe. Come to think of it, you remind me of someone. I hope you'd be friends if you met them. You've got a strong heart as well, don't you? You have a lot of love to give. You're a compassionate person. Now, very quickly, for those of you who vis visited, uh, visited Thunder Goober's personality dungeon, would you like to redeem a token? You cannot do this later on in the game, so do it now. Sure. How freaking exciting! Now enter your token code and get your prizes from your alternate self. Make oh, oh, this is like a um. Go back. Uh, I don't know what this is. Are you sure you're missing out on some very special bonuses? And you can only do this now. This is probably a Kickstarter thing. I just got done watching another streamer named Havature... Havature underscore CH. Cool? Oh, wait. I forgot to ask you something important. Something very important. Tell me, Mako. What is it that you are seriously passionate about? What drives you absolutely nuts and you can't live without? What's your passion? Oh, man. Uh, how do I... Here we go. How, how, wait, how do I... Pussy... In bio. Uh, no, 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 no. My passion? Fuck. Fuck. We'll, we'll say, we'll say streaming. Because I genuinely do really like doing this. Strip. We'll be the goober. We'll give him the goober answer. Chara? Chara? Wow, streaming, that's so great. I love that for you. So nice. I'm glad there's something you truly love. Hold your A rap near and dear once you get it. Take it with you throughout your life. Well, that's it. Thanks for following along. You're so special and cute. Now, Mako, enter the world of Athens. Fulfill your rhapsody. Find out who you truly are. Good luck, Rockstar. Oh, wow. Wow, they've done a lot of work on this game. Welcome to Athens, Mako. Before you start your Rhapsody, you've been given a save file to record your journey. Bring out that big old smiling booty up here, and take a look into the mirror on the shrine. Okay. I can't watch today's stream, but I just wanted to say hi. Hi, Banana Pug. Welcome. Welcome and goodbye. It's always nice to see you, though. Um, okay, this this button runs. We're, we're not Ness Earthbound. We are not Ness Earthbound. Hey there, my name is Mako. Nice to meet you. I love doing homework and going to bed early. 
That's what I would say if I was a really smelly nerd who sits alone at lunch. <laughs> okay. Bye, banana bug. <laughs> Hi, Doc. Welcome, welcome. Somewhere nobody else can go. Somewhere everyone loves to, uh, every loves to be. What? It's this little, special little block of time that we hang out in like bozo losers. Ready to start again, again, and again, and again, and again? This time a little differently, right? That's my guess. You're Ninten. Yeah, I, I am Ninten. Wow, that, I, that monster made me feel attacked. <laughs> What's good, player? Get it? Because you're the player and I'm a, I'm a gangster? Okay. You're so cool. Succumb to the liquid. Succumb to the cum. Uh, it's just a bit... Just a bit of liquid, not too much. Enough to stand in, but not enough to make me sad. What is happening? Sometimes I have these weird emotional moments, and I'm like, Whoa! Hey, stop. We're connected to you. I think we might be best friends, you and I. I don't remember. Okay. Okay, really good job. You're doing sick so far. Like, really well. Now, I'm going to need you to look into your screen and smile really hard. The Athenian Rhapsody has a smile recognition technology. Sure it does. I mean, like, smile so hard it hurts. You really got to smile. You're probably not smiling hard enough. Can you smile a little harder? Like I said, it should be uncomfortable. Okay, so are you, are you just wasting my time? I, I don't understand what's happening. <laughs> I'm just messing with you. You don't have to smile into the mirror. I just wanted to see the embarrassed look on your face when I told you that I've been in here the whole time. Hey there, I'm your save file. My job is to record everything you do along the path to your rhapsody. Think of it less like me stalking you, but more like a mandatory friendship. Also, please keep in mind that this is my job by choice and is not a form of eternal punishment. Now, some important information on how this is going to work. Every time you see a globe, you're going to interact with it. That allows me to save the world and solidify everything you've done prior to your last save. Honestly, though, sometimes I might just save stuff because I feel like it. If I think there are certain things you shouldn't be able to change by reloading the world, I won't let you. Sometimes, I might even write some weird, random things without you knowing. An example would be, player smells like garlic bread. I won't actually write that. Unless you actually do smell like garlic bread, then I will write it. Jokes aside, I'm just telling you that you can save the world at any time you'd like. But me, or your save file, is persistent through your entire Rhapsody. I am literally stuck to this story like grilled on cheese. Got it? Now, how's about we walk on over to that waterfall you spawned in near, and let's get this adventure started, yeah? Lead the way, Mako. Okay. Oh, the globe is just gone. I'll BRB. Okay. B you better be right back. I'm just kidding. You don't have to you don't have to do that. Wow, sure is a long way down, isn't it? As a supportive and understanding friend, please know that I'd never pressure you into jumping down there. I'd push you. You piece of shit. Wow, guys, it's the title. Athenian Rhapsody. Let's see if I can't get rid of these um 3DS borders. There we go. It's literally Undertale. Let's get started. That Rhapsody isn't going to ride itself. Okay. Guys, it's literally fucking Earthbound Undertale. Can't go that way. Um, I've seen development footage of this game for like years. It's, it's been on and off. I keep seeing it. Hey, what's that sound? I'm like over 30% sure that could be the ice cream truck. Let's check it out. What ice cream truck? Totally not the ice cream truck, Jane. What the fuck is this writing? J 
Just some weird kid. Yo, Richard, that's a human. How cool is that? What's your name, bro? Why do you look so confused? Do you speak English? Guessing you don't see handsome Athenians like us running around in the forest often. It's rude to stare. You confidently announce that your name is Mako. The name echoes beautifully off the trees. You said it's Mako? Uh, I don't know why, but I was expecting a cooler name like James. My name is James, by the way. Make sure you remember. James. James rhymes with shblames. I know it's hard memorizing big words, so I'm willing to have some patience. My name's Richard. Pleasure, ple ple ble 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 pleasure to meet you, buddy. Anyways, me and James were about to do what we usually do. Run around in the forest and solve puzzles. It's getting a bit boring because James is pretty bad at them. Maybe you'll do better, though. I'm so excited. Let's get going. Commits new friend group of three, making a very stylish room exit. Okay, we're gonna do we're gonna do some little puzzles. Let's go, Mako, right over here. Human, how many reps can you get on a bench press with 225 pounds? I'm just wondering. Uh, five or six clean reps, easy. Oh, that's it. Richard kid, uh, he could hit like 20 without breaking a sweat. <laughs> He's really awesome. We work out together sometimes. I can show you our home gym later. Fucking home gym. Hey, w watch where you're going, punk. Don't you know where we we we're supposed to fight now? Uh, why do you look so confused? New here or something? What happens is, I attack you in an attempt to take your EXP and level up. You even know what EXP is? This is like talking to a brick wall. Hello, can I get a response? Anything? Whatever, I, I don't have time for this. Get ready to get served, punk. You're being attacked by Squumpy. Oh, he is fucking ugly. Okay. Since you're so dumb, I guess I have to explain to you how to fight, uh huh? You select fight when you want to fight, okay? Your passive options are listed under react. If you've got an item to use, select the bag. Got it? And you have access to special skills called burst here. Use your burst skills a lot, unless you want to lose and die. Now that that's out of the way, you up for a fight? Oh, why, hello there, Mako. Funny seeing you again after all this time. Don't listen to this foolish squirrel, yes. They have no idea what they're talking about. Listen to Thunder Goober only. It has occurred to me that while we were playing silly games together, I've forgotten to relay some crucial information to you. So, let me ask of you. Would you like me to give you the battle tutorial? Uh, no. We'll figure it out. Oh, are you sure? You already know that all that there is to know, hmm? Because if you don't, and you go complain online that you don't understand, it will be very frustrating, yes? You understand? So if you're sure, you must truly be sure. Or we will have a freaking issue, okay? Alright, fuck it, give me the tour. Come on. Oh, yes, you see. I knew that you were just a tad bit stupid, yes? Heads up, dummy. You're about to be hit by an attack! Lesson one, don't die! Ready? Begin! Whoa! Guys, it, oh my god, it's just like Dark Souls. Yeah, we're totally battling now. You understand how this works? It's so easy, dude. Okay. Do you understand what's going on here? Yes? It, it's simple. Even a baby understands. You're going to have to press on the space key to smack this squirrel upside the head. The higher the bar is filled up near the top, the more damage you'll do. Now go on. Hit this sucker in the head. The blue bar underneath me is my health. The pink bar on top of that one is my friend bar. The friend bar shows how close you are to befriending an enemy. My friend bar will never be full, because I think you're a total loser. But, but what if it was? What if it was full? 
Well, it's quite obvious that violence comes naturally to an unhinged child such as yourself. Now, let's learn about the React menu. This is where you can select from a few different battle options that do not involve violence. You'll have one to three dialogue prompts which will allow you to interact and converse with the opponent. But, as you will see along your adventure, often these prompts will contain mini-games and new mechanics of their own. Stay on your toes. This option here is the Make Friends option. Like the foolish squirrel has described in poor detail, you may befriend the opponent once their friend bar is full. Making friends is good! Lastly, this is the option you'll select if you choose to run away. Running away means that you are a quitter and a pussy. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. These guys get really annoying sometimes. He definitely said that, by the way, guys. You can you can always run from a battle. <laughs> Come on, Athens isn't that cruel. Imagine not being able to run away from a random encounter. H how foolish. This reminds me of Undertale. It, it I mean, it's hard not to make the comparison, right? And welcome back, Dark Voids. Dark Voids. What? No, 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 no. No hugging. We're battling. I'll find a way through to you, squirrel. Yeah, we're battling. That's what we're doing. Yeah! Wake up, Tommy! Or else you're gonna get the ointment. <laughs> this is your bag. You can use your items in here, and even equip different armors and weapons on the fly. More importantly, while you weren't looking, I shoved some raw spinach in your back pocket. Go on and eat it! It'll give you big muscles, especially in your forearms. Go on, eat it. Eat it and you're cool. Eat it and you're cool. Oh, fuck. Squumpy is singing along with the battle music, but replacing the notes with squirrel noises. Come on down to burst menu. Last but especially not least, this is the burst menu. You can use special skills using the points shown as a B on top of your device. Burst powers come from the gracious and powerful burst bird, who you will never, ever meet upon your journey. Anyways, by hovering over each skill, you'll see their effect and how much they cost. They can help you turn an impossible battle into a fairly easier one. The burst menu is also where you'll swap between followers. Do you understand that? You swap followers here. Listen, comprehend what I am saying. Okay, that's the whole tutorial. Goodbye and good luck, my special little ball of wonder and light. I'll see you across the finish line. Huzzah! And fuck that guy. Clench your fist and raise your maximum damage output. No, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna heal up a little bit, and then we'll, uh, we'll give him a, we'll squeak with him. The nerve! Cut that out. Oh, he's throwing big nuts. He's got big nuts! Oh, shit! Oh, I can use the D-pad. This changes everything. So, it's been about five turns now. Most players, I think, would have been finished. But it's obvious to me that you're a bit strange and not that great at the whole social thing. I'm gonna do something nice and offer a friendship. What do you say, hat kid? Yeah! You became friends with Squumpy! You should hold hands. We can do that. I, I, I'll i hold his hand. What are you, some kind of vegetarian? You realize you gain no EXP from that, right? Uh, it's like the whole point. Pretty pathetic if you ask me, but it's, it's your life. You just you do what you want. Alright, I take it back. The writing is right up my alley. They just bully each other. Alright, well my puzzle is called Maze of Death and Killing. It's a little extreme, but you can probably handle it. You'll be fine. I, I know you can do it, bud. I believe in you. That's all that really matters. Be careful, please, Mako. It's a sheet of math homework focused on long division. Shit. Don't step in the puddle or your shoes will get wet and you'll be uncomfortable in your socks all day. Who the fuck is this? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. What the fuck? Did the bomb go off? Did you die? What's this? 
It's a whole grain of oatmeal cookie with raisins. Very dangerous. Holy shit. Are you okay? You're almost done. So close, buddy. So close. Final stretch. Human, I'm, I'm so sorry for putting you through that. Seriously, I, I know that was a little too much. At least I know now that you can hold your own. Luckily, I was here to guide you along and you didn't get hurt. What would you do without your good pal, Richard? Honestly, I'm such a good friend. Don't worry about thanking me. I, I already feel lots of appreciation from your weird, unblinking stare. Huge. We did it. Oh, th this... Oh, y you know... Not even close. Not even fucking close to Earthbound, right? Right? Yeah, could couldn't be. Couldn't be an Earthbound gift. You picked up the fresh bar. The fresh bar? You saved the world! Hey, your first save! How awesome is this? I'm gonna record this special moment forever in your save file. Oh, here's another one. Let's beat the shit out of him. God, he does not look good. He looks really fucking ugly. Why are you avoiding my acorns, bro? Because I want to fucking kill you. We need the experience. You're all lumpy and weird like an acorn if it were lumpy and weird. Oh, I don't like that they get hurt animations. Oh, no. I mean, he's fuck ugly, but like, I don't want to... <laughs> I, I don't know. It's making me uncomfortable. Too bad. I, I've lost my remorse for this situation. You leveled up! Who cares? Me! Nice. New attack. 21 max health. 24. New level 2. Awesome. This is just like Dark Souls. What the fuck is that? How do you do, my fellow hip kid? I'm just shredding the gnar per usual. Okay. I trust you. You picked up a blue beetle. This bug is known for its cheesy, creamy filling. It's the most popular type to eat. I wish that was not said. Yes. We're doing more damage. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh! You look like an acorn, except way uglier. Fuck you. I'll beat your ass. Fucking kill him. This battle music is really good. Wow, you're cool. I mean it. I'm sure you do. Very good battle music. Are you friends with Richard? I hear he's a high level. Uh oh. Everyone canonically has levels. My mom tells me I'm not allowed to be near Richard. She says he has a screw loose. But I like screws. Okay. Where is he? Why do we attack the player when our attacks clearly are not very dangerous? Um, that's a great question, dude. I wish I could tell you. A uh, buglert. Shit, it's buglert. Oh, 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 little mites. Oh. Get ready to be punched by quadruple arms. No. Hey, wait, don't I need you for my fucking Pokédex? Shit. <laughs> oh, oh. I'm so excited for whatever we're doing. You know what? Um, <laughs> Pugler doesn't pick up on any social cues and continues to kill you. Okay. Sorry, guy. I thought smiling at him would, like, work. Let's talk. Yeah! That's it? That's all you had to say? 
You're not very good at conversation, are you? Buglert waves back. You know what? That's that's probably it. He's got four arms. Buglert waves as hard as he physically can. Keep waving. Buglert is waving so hard that he forgets to attack. <gasps> you became friends with Buglert. You're telling me nobody died? Lame. So what happens to these little guys? I I'm all alone. Like, huh? Chill mode? The fuck is chill mode? This game is hard. Chill mode will give players who struggle to play Athenian Rhapsody... No, 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 no. Uh, I'm good. H how do we see these little guys? Munchkins? Divine the Munchkin? The fuck you mean? Cool guy. What are these fucking menus? Ducks? I kind of want the ducks. Uh, also, auto run, please. Uh huh, uh huh. Is that a SNES controller? Literally just a Super Nintendo controller? Alright. I, I don't know where these little guys are going when I befriend them. I thought they would, uh, become my, my actual party members. Hey, Mako, have you ever seen one of these before? We call it a camera. It's another one of those things that's just, like, here with no explanation. But it's super cool and friendly. It takes photos and stores them, uh, somewhere. That's not important. The important thing is that I can store that photo in your Rhapsody. You like a cute little memory. So if you ever see one of these and want to take a commemorative photo to represent your rap, feel free. I can only store one photo at a time, so make sure you pick a good one to represent your story. Adventure resume. You're looking real pretty right now. Would you like to take a flick with the camera? Yeah. Now you're playing with power. Yeah, this is very much just, j just Earthbound. Oh, look at this guy. Oh! Get the pants away from me before I call the cops, weirdo. The nerve is some people. Is, is it gonna be the same? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Very funny and unique dialogue from that frog. Holy fucking shit. I did not see him. Alright. Let's kick his ass! I don't know if there's any point in befriending these guys at all. Uh, so for now, I'm just gonna kick the shit out of him. Oh my god, he's throwing so many nuts! Uh, on, on a weird topic, have you guys ever tried to eat an acorn? <laughs> I, I may have tried to eat an acorn when I was a lot younger than I am now. I, this was not like a last week thing. But it could have been a last week thing. Uh, I, I don't have the money for this shit. No, 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 no. Is that a fucking Hypno from Pokemon? I'd prefer it if you stayed very far away from me. I'm not sure if my rash is contagious. Okay. No, but I learned how to a while back. You learned how to eat acorns? Uh, you're not supposed to eat them raw, from what I've heard. Oh, Cornball, nice to meet you here for the first time ever in my life. Nice to meet you indeed. Uh, allow me in to introduce myself, since this is the first time we've ever met. Yes. I am the... I am the... I am, uh, I am the... Uh, my name is, uh... My name is Doug. Yeah, yes, my name is Douglas. Good to meet you, yes, I am Douglas. The badge guy. Now, here's my deal, my silly little blossoming butterfly in your cocoon. Yes, in the cocoon still. 
I would like to reward you with special prizes to don your Rhapsody with. You gotta cook them because of poison or something? Oh. Really? <laughs> um. Really? Poison? Uh. <laughs> um. Okay. I may have eaten, like, a couple of them at some point. By befriending each Athens roaming enemy in a given biome, I will give you a badge to put on your Rhapsody if you so choose. If you complete each of my badge challenges, you shall get a special postmark for your Rhapsody's completion. Yes. This way you can show all your friends that you are very social. Yes, yes. I know that often kids your age have trouble with socializing, as you are all so obsessed with your technology. How crazy, oh my gosh. It's simple. You befriend everyone, you talk to me, I give you a prize or two upon the win of your Rhapsody. Capiche? Now, let's give you your evaluation on friends for the planes. Oh, well, you've befriended Squumpy, and you've befriended Bulgurt. Squeezel needs friends pronto. Go befriend Squeezel. You must befriend Cattail. Yes, you must befriend them, please. And now for the area's final score. You're not freaking done, obviously. Go make all the friends and then come back, stupid head. Okay. For sure. Who are you? Squeezel. Yeah. Oh, wait, friends, right, friends. Oh, shit! Squeezel's palm is sweating like a fountain of disgustingness. That That is pretty gross. Uh, let's... Let's sneeze. Fuck. Dude, you're sick, aren't you? Stay away from me, oh gosh darn it. But stay away from me, he says, as he fucking closes in on me. Yeah, I've got one of those. I pick my nose, but not my face nose. Uh-huh. You pick your asshole? Which nose? Well, not my face nose, that's for sure. My other nose! Okay, which fucking nose? Which nose? My not face nose, the other nose. This guy's insane. I'm confused. What's your real name? My real name? Uh, it's Micah. Nice to meet you. Mako. No, no, I asked, what's your real name? I told you. Mako? No, I asked, what's your real name? You became friends with Squeezel. That's great! I guess, if it makes you happy. It's not bad. It's not bad writing. Can I have this? Thank you. Don't, don't talk about the fucking cheesy, creamy filling of the blue bug every time. Uh, also, I feel like I can collide with these, and I can't. You saved the world! Hey, your second save point. How awesome is this? Definitely less awesome than the first one. Okay. Mako, Richard made a sick puzzle for you to try out. I've done it once before. It's hard as heck. He said I can help you, because you probably can't figure out. Figure it out. Damn, I am stupid. It's a three-parter, but I never got past level two. James tags along. You can now, you now switch to James during the battle in your burst menu. By selecting burst, you'll have access to yours and James's skills too. Okay, well, I didn't want to go that way quite yet. 
This is me and Richie's home gym, or as I like to call it, the Ultra Bro Zone. They are poisonous and can kill you if you eat them raw. I'm still here. <laughs> I didn't die yet. I, uh, I ate like two or three acorns. Not like the whole thing, but like I had little bits of them and then I was like, oh, this is terrible. Like I kept trying them and I was like, oh, this is, these, these are really bad. This is where me and Richie hit the bench press. He's great at it, but my arms are too short to reach the bar. I usually just lay down and grunt really hard and pretend that I'm lifting up a huge weight. I think I'm still getting stronger from it. Motivational posters. It's all about the muscles, baby. Weights get dates, or that's what McFishness says. McFishness is my bodybuilding idol. I'd love to meet him one day. He's like a big sweaty fish guy, except jacked. And he owns a gym way up high in the Heimel Tundra. For my birthday one year, Richard hired a professional artist to paint the portrait of me. Doesn't it look just like me? Um, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, these are my super heavy dumbbells. They're about 10 pounds each. Yeah, not too heavy for me, but uh, maybe for you. Uh, this is the punch rock. You can punch it, and it hardens your hand. Last time I punched it, I only cried for a few minutes. So I'm improving. Nice, nice, good shit. Okay, let's do these puzzles. Okay, Mako, my next puzzle is called Push Button. This one is actually kind of hard, so I allowed James to help you. Maybe you guys can figure it out, though. I'd be very impressed. Push Button. So it's literally just... Uh-huh. <laughs> yep. Okay, good job. That uh, seemed pretty easy. But I'm sure the next one will stump you. What does this say? Rich? Oh, this is a fake button Richard put down to trick you. It almost worked. Uh, it sure did. Oh, no. It's, it's gone. No, you can't pass until you finish this puzzle. It's not that hard anyways. What? 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 Where is it? What? What? The fucking you sucked the button up your asshole. Where is it? No. Oh. Dang, I for sure thought that one would trip you up. Whatever. I I have uh, one final puzzle. I'm sure it's gonna be a riveting and crazy fucking puzzle. My final puzzle is... What is... Do you know algebra? Long, long division is too hard without scrap paper. Wait, wait a second. <laughs> what can we do? The speed at which you're completing these puzzles is getting suspicious. Gotta make this one super hard. This is a spelling question. Please spell Richard to the best of your ability. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna do bitchard. And I'm gonna see if the video game notices that it's bitchard. Oh, it won't let me. It literally won't let me. We got this, we got this. Check it out, check it out. Oh. Hmm. So, Richard is spelled as Richard, huh? I see. The funny thing is, if you ask me, I, I think that just might be correct. Richard. Very suspicious, if you ask me. Well, to be honest, I don't even know how it's spelled. The fact that you're able to spell anything at all makes me wonder. What other evils you're capable of? What do you, what do you fucking mean? Oh! You being attacked by another Squeezel! 
I befriended him, right? Yeah, I did. Ow. God damn. I actually don't do much squeezing anymore, ironically. Oh. Well, ne now you're never going to squeeze again. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? We got the bullshit. Picked up a blue beetle. I'm not going to read that again. Hey, chump. Watch where you lug on those heavy feety eyes. It's Buzz Buzz. Something tells me you're fixing to get your butt kicked, huh, bucko? You want to get served, huh? By the meanest, cleanest, big bad bug on the block? You think you're so tough, huh? Yeah? Yeah. Well, too bad for you. It's not even worth beating you up. For now, I suppose. You probably won't give me much EXP and, uh, and have uh, lots of stinky health points, don't you? Yeah, I bet. Suppose I'll, uh, I'll, I'll smell you later, tough guy. I'll, uh, I'll show you who's tough. Yeah. See you, nerd. Whatever. Jeez, what a bully. What's that guy's problem? Or should I say, what's that fly's problem? Ah? Uh? I want to talk to them. They're cute. Just two friends walking around in the woods. <laughs> I wonder what'll happen, uh... Will they hold hands? Who knows? No, no. We will not be holding hands. There was a pair sitting inside this box. How strange. Hey everyone, how are you all today? I'm doing okay, Lucario. Welcome to the stream. It's so nice out today. Usually on days like this, me and Rich Bomb just run around in the forest. It's lots of fun. One time we had a mud eating contest. He swept the floor with me naturally. He's very multi talented, as you can tell. Wait a, wait a second, human friend. Something is weird about this shrub. There's nothing weird about it. What's. What's weird about it? Holy fucking shit. Puzzle time. Human buddy, since you're new here, you have to pass the initiation puzzle. Oh, right, the initiation puzzle. The frat, frat guy initiation. You gotta like, come on something. This is horrible. I remember this, an Athenian classic. Yup, human, if you would please step below into the puzzle chamber. This is just, there's knives and spikes. What do you, the puzzle is called throw knife. You have to dodge the knives I throw at you until time is up. Are you ready? Puzzle begin. Okay, shit. How much do you want to bet left and right? Okay. Distraction. What the fuck, asshole. Hey, hey, shut the fuck up. This is not fair. This is not fair. Fuck you. You're being a dick. Time's up. Congrats, human. You survived the puzzle. I mean, figured out the solution. You did so great. Super proud of you. Glad you're not dead. I'm gonna find a... Or get, go set up another fun and safe puzzle. Be right back, buddy. This is the puzzle? Here I thought they were gonna challenge you to a children's card game. No. Man, I'm like totally not upset that you guys didn't include me in that or whatsoever. So I healed you up though. That looked fun. <laughs> Throwing knives at people is not fun, man. Dog. The door doesn't seem to open. Locked. Some have come to call the phenomenon. I love the amount of sass that the writing has. It's very nice. Me and Richard used to get bored sometimes. That's why he builds these puzzles in the woods. It's like a game we play together. Who are these freaks? Hey bro, you ever try minding your own business? Sorry. 
You saved the world, or did I save the world? Maybe James saved the world, but I think really you saved my world, cutie pie. Okay, okay, sorry, sorry. There's not much else to do around here other than eat tree bark and stare at clouds. Actually, I haven't eaten tree bark in a long time. It upsets my stomach, believe it or not. It stinks, but whatevs. Yo, after we're done running around and getting uh, EXP, we should hit the weights, right? Would you want to hit the home gym after uh, with me and our dog? Would you? I'll interpret your cold silence as I am too excited to speak, but yes, I will hit the weights with you, broski. You picked up the pointy twig. This short sword will give you an edge over your opponents. I had a fucking leaf. I, I had a leaf? How useless. Human, wait a second. Take a look. Sometimes I get overwhelmed and I like to stare out onto the water for a bit. It helps me calm down. I'm sure you might get a bit scared or anxious being new to Athens and all. Do you? New things are scary for everyone. Would you want to look with me? It's very calming. You seem like you could use a minute. Don't worry. Athens is awesome. Me and Richie have loads of fun, and you can stick with us however long you want. Even if things have been a bit different since all he talks about is EXP. Sometimes I feel like I'm a burden to him, or I'm too much, or that I'm annoying. It makes me really upset to think like that. I don't want to be annoying. I'm just excited, and I love being around my friends. Trying to clear my mind on this bridge helps me forget those bad thoughts and get back to enjoying my day. But sometimes, I still need a moment by myself to just think about things. I need to process my emotions for a while. Do you ever do that too? I choose not to have emotions. I'm a slow processor. Yeah, you look like someone who doesn't process information very fast. Ah, <laughs> uh, whatever. I'm having a lot of fun hanging out today with you and Richard. I hope you like him. He's a great friend to me. He really is. He saved me from this terrible maze called someone's horrible maze of death and killing. How awesome is he, right? Make like a tree and leaf? That's good, I like that. I buy a cattail, okay, okay. I'm gonna gas him up. Gas him up. Me, I'm the final boss. You sure are, buddy. Holy fucking shit, you sure are. Oh, we got Zelda jumping. Agree, yes. That mean you die, human, and bad guy. No, 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 no. I don't die. You will be the one who will... Well, you'll be a friend. Haha, <laughs> bad guy says you can go free. You became friends with Cattail. Look at you making friends and stuff. Cool. I still don't know how much impact that will have on the gameplay. At all. But that's okay. Richard! Richard, bro, I literally missed you so much! Okay, dude, but you gotta step, step back a few steps, man. You're like way up in my grill. Dude, you have to move backwards. I cannot breathe with you all up in my space! That's good. You can stop there. I don't understand why this is a constant conversation with you. What makes you think I want you standing so close to me? I really can live without smelling your stinky breath all over my face. It disturbs me to no end, bro. You're literally breathing inside of my mouth. It's disgusting. Totally, dude. Whatever you, whatever you say, my main man. Human! How are you? How was your experience in my puzzle gauntlet? I may owe you an apology for nearly killing you a few times, but look at you! You lived! You're so special and cool. So special. So cool. Yes. Yeah, so, uh, 
I figured James and I would make you a special present for being such an awesome friend. We want to express our gratitude and love of your presence in the form of modern art. Yeah, we're going to make an art project for you. Richard is a really good artist, so it'll be awesome as heck. Yes, James. An art project for our new friend, as we discussed. Well, let's get started, James. Come on, that project won't finish itself. Yeah, I'm, I'm so excited. Let's get started for our new buddy. All right. Fuck him up. He kind of looks like Olimar's helmet. Like Pikmin. Pikmin Olimar. Oh my god. My attack's so strong, so hard dodge, not can win you. Jesus. You speak so strangely, Cattail. This music is such a fucking bop, though. Us aquatic mammals gotta stick together. It's hard life for us, you knows. Well, luckily it's over. Don't worry about it. Hey, you won! That's good. Maybe. Who's this fella? This place is my favorite! I love to eat the green cheese on the floor! What? This game looks like fun. I wonder if it's on the Switch. It's probably on the Switch. Hey, chump. You think you got off easy last time, huh? I think I ought to fix you up. Set you straight, huh? What do you say, punk? Feeling lucky? Uh, yeah. Yup. You, uh, you're feeling lucky all of a sudden, huh? That's great! Great for you, bro! Well, you're right. You are lucky. Lucky that I won't kick your butt right now, because I'm busy. Too busy for you. So, out of my way, bub. Heard me? Yeah, okay. Capiche? Understood? The fuck is that guy's problem? It's just Buzz Buzz if he was an asshole. It's like New Yorker Buzz Buzz. This, this battle system is not bad. Not bad. I, I think I prefer Knuckle Sandwich, if you've seen that. The battle system in that is really fucking good. If you haven't played Knuckle Sandwich, you should totally give it a shot. Wow, a shiny new level. How's it feel? P -p -p pretty pretty alright. I guess I'll figure out how it feels here in a minute. I've chosen to reside in this side of the pond due to my peer's habit of passing gas. I'm making fart bubbles. Yeah, you sure are, actually. Hello, friend. I like how some of the enemies will just talk to you. Oh, it's a rock. Don't take your legs for granted. Be careful. Or be, be, be grateful you're a rolling stone, not collecting moss. <laughs> I'm stuck. What do you mean you're stuck? I can't help you. Sorry. Can I get two at once? No. That's unfortunate. 45 damage. Holy. Half cat, half tail, half awesome. Prepare to die. I don't like- I don't like making them, like, hurt. <laughs> like, it makes me feel uncomfortable. <laughs> Insert smiling emoticon into message. Mm. Mm, mm mm Seems you forgot to do something. What the fuck? He changed into a different... enemy. Is there an audio cue for that? I think there is. 
Oh. I'm so excited for whatever we're doing. I might have to get off stream. It's buffering like hell. Is it? Is it buffering for anyone else? See ya. Have a good night, Dark Voids. Is it buffering for anyone else? If it's buffering for, for everyone, I can go ahead and restart it. Not for me? Okay. I was about to say, it might be me. Because I'm looking at OBS. And a few elements of OBS are lagging for some reason. So I don't know what's going on, but... It's probably fun. As long as it's not uh, doing it for everyone. You broke off a section of the comically large sandwich. A note says, human can have, we full, cattails. Cool, can I... I guess I can't have the, the whole thing. I mean, like, my Wi-Fi is shitty. Oh, okay, okay. All right, I just wanted to make sure it wasn't bothering anyone else. But I'll see you, I'll see you soon, Dark Voids. Have a good night. Goobo Park? I kind of want to go to Goobo Park. What the fuck is Goobo Park? I love that talking noise. It's just meowing. Hey there, welcome to Goobo Park. Unfortunately, we're only accepting bugs and friends of bugs at this time. Damn. It's kind of racist. It's, it's fucked up, man. I want to go. Mako, me and James are doing an art project and I need your advice. If there was a statue somewhere, would it have your head on it or mine? It would have your head on it. Would it have a muscular or round body? Oh, it'd be muscular, man. It'd be huge. Would it have a chainsaw for a weapon or a katana? Theoretically. That's uh, pretty specific. We'll, s we'll say it has a katana. Okay, Th thank you for your input, buddy. This has been bugging me all day. So we're definitely going to fight a boss that looks like that. A pond snack? Excuse the fuck out of me. That's so crazy. What Jessica say after that? Jessica say that Rebecca make out with Brad, but I think she lie. Me think she lie too. Jessica is so crazy. We chilling like am villain. These are interesting dialogues. Oh shit! You looking pretty mad right now. Would you like to take a flick with the camera? Yeah. We'll always take with the flick with the take a flick with the camera. Who's this? Miss Pac-Man? Okay. That's all this is. We're just gonna Yeah, they're just having a party. Uh, I'm good. I don't need to hear about all this drama between a bunch of toddlers, essentially. Hey there, Mako, I have a cool, fun, safe, team-oriented puzzle. Sounds fun, right? Am I in danger? You're so funny, human. Technically, your life is always in danger. Stop complaining. Let's get started. So, this puzzle is called Math Questions. I won't explain the rules because James told me you already know them. I didn't say that. We'll do me and you on a team against James since he sucks and it'll be fun to beat him. <laughs> okay. All right, I'll play defense while you go and steal James's flag. Ah, I see you're coming for my flag. Now I have to ask you a math question. I have one pancake tied to a string in November. The humidity in the air is 40% and I took a shower three days ago. Then I move three inches to the left, spin around twice and say barbecue sauce backwards in slow motion. Are you following? Pay attention, bro. If I then skip two rocks, wait three seconds, and then blink my left eye, how many units of grass have I consumed in the past week and three-fourths? Trick question. How much cheese were you carrying with you? Jeez, you're a smart fella. Looks like I'm just a fart smeller, huh? I guess you can take my flag to your side. 
Thanks, dude. Appreciate it. What's going on? W where are you going? What? I actually decided to switch teams. Playing defense is boring, so I switched to offense. Also, you lose. That means you have to undergo the punishment. You have to give James 10 bucks. You did lose fair and square after all. Man, fuck you. What? Boy, oh boy. My first time winning. I think I'm going to throw the money into the ocean for good luck. Or maybe I'll flush it down the toilet. That sure was a lot of fun. See, I told you it'd be safe. Please go away now. I need a break from you. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, come on, James. I told you we should have released it a second earlier. Now the whole prank is ruined. It would have been a funny prank. It would have been really fucking funny. This guy's a YouTube prankster. Human, we have something super awesome to show you. Come with us. There's a bug. I want the bug. Go see our art project. I'm literally so excited. Go up there, go up there. We made a present for being such a great friend for uh, to us. We worked really hard on it. I sincerely hope you like it. This is a token of our everlasting friendship. I can tell you're excited. I can barely stand still. Oh my gosh. Hi, Python. The statue has the word Richard inscribed on its foot. How nice. Cool. I'm really glad you took the time to observe our craft and recognize our raw passion for creating fine art. This took us almost a full hour to build, only using dried mud and rusty spoons we found on the floor. Alright, well, I guess we'll see you later. I, uh... thought we'd fight it. What is this back here? Oh, there's a mushroom. A mushroom. Fuck me, I thought that hurt me. Oh, we can we can go down quickly by pressing down. Oh, this is amazing. These are innovative changes. Look at that. Wow. So cool. So epic. Let's go, baby. Me thinks I'm winning. No. Not quite. Sorry, little guy. Winner, winner, rigatoni dinner. I don't think I've ever had rigatoni. That's just, I know that's a weird thing to bring up, but I don't think I've ever had rigatoni. The wiener dog stares out onto the ocean. Arf. I dream of solitude. I want to leave this noisy town and live in seclusion in the forest. Dude. I feel that. I feel that. Arf, arf. Will you escort me to a more suitable home if you know of one? Sure, buddy. The wiener dog tags along. Borp. Oh, camera. Fuzzy pickles. You know, come to think of it, I mean, I don't really know where to put you, buddy. Yeah, I don't know. I really don't know where to put you. Hello, cornball. It's me, the... Uh, my, name, my name is Doug. Yes, I'm the badge guy. I give you badges for making friends with everyone, even the weirdos, if you recall. Yes. Now, let's give you your evaluation on friends for the planes. Oh, well, you have befriended Squumpy, you have befriended Buglert, you have befriended Squeezel, and against all odds, you have befriended Cattail. And now for the area's final score. What? Jesus Christ. Flaming Jumping Jaguars of Elysium! You freaking done it, Cornball! 
You've befriended all the jack wagons in the area, by golly. Now, you'll receive a special badge to commemorate the friends you made in the plains. So long, cornball. See you to your next spy home for the friend making appointment. Yes! Alright, see ya. Thanks. What the fuck is the badge? What did you give me? What? Huh? I have no idea what this motherfucker just gave me. Probably nothing. Pickles, full stop. What do you what do you mean pickles full stop? I like pickles. You don't like pickles? This guy's talking faster than Germa. What do you mean? I don't know where to drop this fucking dog off. I don't mean, like, stop the pickles. Huh? Pickles are great. I just mean pickles. With a full stop at the end. Oh. I see. Fuzzy pickles. Human. Richard is being attacked by a nasty monster. Can you help me? I don't know what to do. Oh. Human. This is quite embarrassing for me. Richard. The great... Uh, to ask of you... <laughs> you must rid me of this pesky bug. It simply will not leave me alone. This is also a very great opportunity for you to earn EXP. Maybe you won't always be such a weakling. Show us what humans are capable of. Yeah, buddy. That's it. You're messing with the wrong fly. Yeah, get dunked on. 360 no scope. Get wrecked, noob. I'm about to take all your EXP, pink fella. Haha, <laughs> woohoo! You see how annoying this thing is? I don't even want to waste my time defeating it. It's not worth the EXP. But I think for someone your level, this is a great opponent. You're on your way to being strong like your best pal Richard, after all. Human, wait! I know Richard is telling you that you need all the XP you can get, but you, you don't have to kill things for your XP. Maybe we can make friends instead. Maybe that way we can get a bit closer to how Athens used to be before everyone was so EXP crazed and attacked each other on sight. That was a joke, right? This world is all about EXP now. Everybody knows that without killing each other, or without killing other Athenians to take their EXP for your own, you're dead meat. Human, I'm going to temporarily team up with you for this fight. Together, we will beat the living shit out of this disgusting, horrible, dubious, malicious bug. I know that I'm what you'd call thick with three C's and a Q. Oh, but that just means I have a higher base defense stat. <laughs> Don't worry about your wiener dog friend. He'll be right back in the same spot you found him before the fight. Please, Mr. Wiener Dog, understand that I must aid my brethren in this battle this once. You may retreat this time. Harnessing the power of Richard and... Yeah! Mako, attack with all your might! Slay this foul beast who dare ling lay a finger upon Richard! Oh, you wanna play like that? Bring it on, fat boy! No. No, we won't be killing him. He's pathetic. Buzz. The fly does a backflip. Oh, I'm- I'm the man. Well, what's preventing me from just getting him killed? I am quite literally awesome. Do you feel my cool, very macho, and cunning appeal? Um. Yeah. God damn. His big hitbox sucks. I am literally the coolest ever. Spawn a power shield that eats three hits. Let's, let's switch to me. Well, why would I insult or mock him? The fly buzzes back in an aggressive fashion. You don't make friends by insulting or mocking them. Although it is pretty funny. The fly buzzes back in such a manner that sounded uh, quite like a mosquito and not like a fly. 
And yes, it is the Earthbound font, Ixel. Do you feel utterly hopeless? You should, because I very well may kill you. You you are pretty strong, little guy. The fly buzzes back in such a manner that ah yes, it sounds like a mosquito. A mosquito. I can tell you're having a hard uh, trouble dodging my attacks. Haha! <laughs> Too bad for you. I can attack twice in a row. This game has earned a place in my backlog of games. It's it's pretty cool looking. I did that purposefully. I aim to win this fight and take your EXP. The fly buzzes back in a wimpy way. Shit. I gotta stop using the stick. It's causing me to go a little too far in certain directions. As the great flies of the past have said. What have they said? Tell me. Oh, fucking shit. No, it's not about size. It's actually about EXP and persistence. Yeah, this game is very, very much... I mean, obviously, right? It's very much like Undertale. The fact that you're still alive worries me. But... It's good. It's not bad. Uh, the writing is not exactly how I would like it to be, just because there's a little bit of uh, th there's a little bit of annoying writing, but that happens. It seems to me you're quite the formidable foe. I see that I may not win this fight at this rate. If you want to know a game that actually stopped me from playing it because it had shit writing. Uh, and it just annoyed me whenever I read it. Um. It was Corn Kids 64. Which looked really cool on the surface. And it was pretty cool. But sometimes the writing of a video game will actually just make me be like, No. I know. I'm okay. You became friends with the fly. Look at you making friends and stuff. Well, human, this is goodbye. I hope that we meet again sometime soon. Being a bully is wrong. I've decided to devote my life to charity and helping those in need thanks to you. As for you, Richard, I hope we can become the best of friends one day. I sincerely love you guys. I was hoping you wouldn't let me down and that you'd kill it. You obviously don't understand how things work around here, huh? Don't mind Richard. Sometimes all he cares about is EXP. It's bothersome. Not everything had to be about leveling up. It's frustrating. We barely have fun anymore. It's EXP this and EXP that. You saved the world. You saved the world. That that's it? Alright. Welcome to Primo! Mako, emergency! Quickly, listen up! We have a problem! I am not legally responsible for anything. What? Dude, I was totally kidding. That's like, really concerning that you immediately said that. Nothing's actually wrong. I was just bored. I thought I'd take a second and introduce you to Primo. Congrats on making it this far into your Rhapsody! I've realized that during most of your adventure, I haven't been recording everything as closely as I should be. In my quest to entertain myself by making snarky comments that only I find funny, I've totally dropped the ball on the whole data collection thing. Therefore, I thought I'd ask you some stuff along the course of your A-Rap. Sound cool? How about you tell me, what's your favorite food? Shit. Uh... It's, 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 shit. <laughs> it's, 
If you've never had this before, it's a, it's, a, it's like a rice porridge. It's very tasty. Oh, wait. I, I asked you something, right? I, I totally forgot. I'm not even kidding. I just completely zoned out. That's so quirky. Oh, my Athena. This is embarrassing. Can't take this guy anywhere. Am I right? <laughs> All right. Well, could you tell me it again? Yeah, I gotcha. I gotcha. One more time, right? It's it's like a it's like a rice porridge. It's pretty good. You should try it sometime. Oh, it's kanji. That's so brave of you. Remember, I, I don't judge. <laughs> Not out loud. Now, just two more things. Do you prefer kanji with the bone or boneless? Now that's a real question we can get into. I prefer it boneless. You when you cook the chicken, you. Scrape the meat off the bone. Get the meat off the bone. It's boneless. Boneless. Like I said before, I don't judge. Last question. Do you eat your boneless kanji on a roll? No. No, you don't put it on bread. Man, you really eat kanji off a plate like a child. No, it goes in a bowl. It goes in a bowl because it's like a rice porridge, see? That's like pizza roll, chicken nugget, baby type behavior. I didn't mean to take up so much of your time. I, I just thought this would be a fun way to bond and stuff, yeah? Go have some fun in Primo and relax a bit. You've earned it. Wait, wait, stop! I almost forgot. Please listen. Important. Do you bust it down with the sauce? Yeah, I bust it down with the Athenian style with the sauce. Word. Now, resume adventure. Who? What? What did I walk into? Who's putting kanji in a roll? Hi, Rufus. It's... It's, a. Uh, you've never had... Have you ever had kanji? It's delicious. Chicken kanji specifically. With, like... You put, like, ginger in it. Oh, my God. I love kanji. See? This guy gets it! This guy gets it! Richard basically runs this place, being that he is the most EXP out of us all. That's pretty much how things work around Athens now. I'm, I'm surprised to meet someone else who actually genuinely knows what this dish is, by the way. Nah, man, I eat kanji. You eat fucking letters? I eat letters! I eat letters, Charlie! I start eating garbage! Throw in some green onions and log on my yes. Oh my god, dude. Dude, dude! Oh my god, I, I want it now. You're making me want it. But I do not have the money to cook these things. So, it shall wait until next week. So tasty. Yeah, it's it's good. Man. Love symbols. This town is so bogus. Totally like, heck the system. And it's, it's not a phase, mom. Yeah, that guy's cool. Oh my god, he's loud. There's no problem being patient and timing your attacks carefully for maximum damage. The higher your potential to put out damage is, the more precise you should be to get in the higher damage ranges. Okay, cool. Do you usually barge into, be into people's homes uninvited? Yeah, I guess so. Sorry. Oops. They're out to get me, I'm certain. I won't come down. What do you mean? You hungry? My bro and I were about to whip up some fresh mulch. Yeah. The sink is clogged with grass and flowers. Nice, dude. Nice. You love to see it. Yeah, that's right. We don't all want to fight. Some of us just want a delightful oceanside condo to live in. Let's go, mulch! Yeah! That all right with you, tough guy? That's fine with me. You look like an eggplant. I'm thinking of moving to Olympus one day. But for now, I can't possibly afford those property prices. Big Squeezel will throw you to other places you've traveled to in the past. It hurts really badly, but it's convenient. Big Squeezel? I hand-painted every single one of these Primo signs out of pure love for my city. More like... mouth-painted. True. Hello. You want a hundred dollars? Please take it. Me not want the monies. Fucking sure. Okay. Now give it back. Okay. 
Oh, 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 he's just like that now. The crow mumbles something incomprehensible and starts to scribble on his notebook. Yeah, I think I got a side of hash browns with that. Oh, it doesn't come with it? Oh. What? Don't order the fry, always order the fish, but smell it first. What? What? Oh my fucking lord. Let me throw you, come on, I'll throw you real far, come on. Let me throw you, bro, come on! No. I... <laughs> okay. A statue of the hero, the Athenian champion who protects the land's creatures from cruel rhapsody chasers and the likes. Bank said me not allowed to get loan for house. Me say for why? Me have good credits. Smells like no smells like nobody's home right now. I'm trying to get some new slang to stick in the city. Sounds cheese alicious, huh? Last week I tried getting people to start saying bananas, but it didn't catch like I thought it would. That's interesting. Let's store my bugs. Event boat. Hey man. Oh, well, would you look who it is? It's Mako! I mean, I'd assume that's your name, for no reason in particular. We've never met before, you and I. Hmm. Yes, yes, I'm a different person than the one you're thinking of. Correct. I am not a wizard. No, I'm just a silly little sailor boy. Oh, yes, that's, that's me, I am. Captain Goober. And, and I must share with you something. Something special for you and I. Yes, something we can both do together. <laughs> Tee -hee. Now, if you, my special little cornball, have a special specific rhapsody in your clutches, I may take you somewhere special. Yes, you've guessed it correctly. Huzzah! I will bring you to special event locations. By receiving special specific rhapsodies, you will unlock special specific circumstances. Yes, yes, you will. I will let you know when you have one of these special specific rhapsodies, yes. Don't worry. I am organized. We shall sail upon the Athenian rhapsody boat. Yes, oh yes, we shall, my friend. <laughs> yes. So, I hope you comprehend what I'm saying to you. You get an event, Rhapsody, you bring it here, we go. Anyways, let's check if you've got a special specific adventure for us to partake upon, yes? It seems to me that... Hmm... You have nothing! Yes, nothing at all! <laughs> get away from me now. Do not come back, Cornball. Yes, don't. Yes, for if you do not get the fuck out of my face, uh, now I will call the police on you, hmm? Yes, well, thank you regardless. Okay. Sorry. What's going on here? Hey. It's good, player. Poser. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Chillin'. You got time? Yeah. Word. Chill for a sec. Maybe, uh... Turn around, too. The smile's freaking me out a bit. How long is this going to take? I can't do anything. Oh! Anyways, uh, have a cup of tea. You seem like you could use it. Luckily, I have an extra behind me. Is that, is that all? Shit, nice. Thanks. <laughs> what? What is, what is back here? What the fuck? What are you? What are you? What the fuck is this? Fish fry? Hey there, and look at this fucking fish JPEG on the door. What the hell? Hey there, and welcome to Fish Fry's pre-prepared fish vault, where the fish, fish is fried, frozen, shipped across Athens, and fried again. Our sensor must detect that you are an employee of Fish Fry based on your scent. Our sensor detects... That you do not give off a strong, crispy fish scent. Access denied. That's that's the shittiest verification system ever. <laughs> and it tells you. It tells you exactly what it's looking for. 
Look at this. Another JPEG of a fucking fish on the ground. Look, I, I wanted to talk to this guy. Hi, sport. I'm the party manager. If you've got a party, I can manage it for you. Yeah? But it looks like there isn't a party for me to manage. Foolish, foolish. Okay. What the fuck is this? There's something shining over here. No, 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 no. I want... Oh, no, there's more. Wait up, Mako. Hold on for a second. I'm catching up. Mind if I hang out with you for a bit? Haven't seen Richard in a little while. Not too sure where he went. He seemed weird after that battle with the fly. He gets like that sometimes. I'm sure he's just out making new puzzles or something. He does that sometimes. Anyways, I'll stick with you for a bit. We can chill, just dudes being dudes. Cool. This is the Forest of Fortune. It's a bit confusing to navigate, but if we get lost, at least we'll be together. Also, we can hold hands if you want. Just putting that out there. No, I, I, I'm good. Uh, I'm good, buddy. You saved the world and you look great doing it. That save is so quick that it may it's like making me think am I really saving? Um, but Unfortunately I'm sorry everyone. I think that is all I can muster tonight. I Think that's all I can muster tonight. I Am feeling like a like a like a really tired guy. It's been uh, I've been getting really tired lately I don't know what it is Maybe there's a maybe there's a little 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 gremlin doing a tired dance on me. But let's find someone else who's playing Athenian. Oh my shit! Jabroni Mike is playing Athenian Rhapsody. We're gonna raid Jabroni Mike. We're gonna raid Mister Micus tonight. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, that little look at Athenian Rhapsody. That's a pretty cool little game. Um, I've been waiting for a little while, actually, to play this. It's been a few years, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, I'm pretty sure I first saw this game in, like, 2020. So, yeah, it's it's been a while. But we're going to go ahead and get going. And uh, tomorrow I will probably be streaming, like, Mario Kart or something. If I don't have any other plans. But we'll see. As always. Um, I'm going to go ahead and put my links. In the chat. If you haven't joined the discord. What the fuck are you doing? Get in there. Come on. Come on. Get in the discord. That's the only thing I ask of you. Twitter and YouTube. Optional. Although I do like. You know when people go to both. But again. Always up to you. Thanks for the stream. No problem. Um, aside from that, remember, last thing, always very important, go tell a loved one that you care about them. Say something nice to them. Check in on them. Make sure everything's okay. These things matter. But aside from that, I will let you go. Have a great rest of your night. We're going to go ahead and raid Mike. And I will see you, very possibly, tomorrow. Have a great night, guys. I'll see you around.